through trips across Birmingham could be banned by the City Council as part of plans to cut pollution. Vehicles will be able to enter the centre but will have to return to the ring road to access other parts of the city. The council is also considering making residential roads 20 miles per hour and rerouting the A38. The Birmingham Transport Plan was launched this Monday and sets out the city's vision for the next decade and comes after the council was given a final warning to clean up its air quality. It's hoped that once in place, citizens make greater use of public transport, cycling and walking. I think, you know, it, it works to a degree. People can get the public transport into the city centre. Obviously, it, it, it's going to make it better for everyone. But at the same time, not everyone's able to do that. If you're a contractor or something like that, for example, but it's your work to come into town. You're going to need your van for your supplies. I, I don't think it's going to be, it's not going to work very well for people or that, you see. Um, but I think in, so if you're an office worker or something like that, it might be useful for you if you've just got a suitcase or something. Then, um, But I think in, in, in the long run, it's not going to be the best, no. Well, you're from a part of the city that's not that well served for public transport. You haven't got a train, for no, example. No, no. So are the buses reliable enough to not use the car? The, the buses, I, I guess they are. But then if you're going to force people to a degree to use public transport, you're going to have to up that as well. And you're going to have to, and then it's staffing that, getting more people to run that, making sure that they are on time because you know, everyone knows public transport's not the best at the best of times, especially with weather and circumstances. So, yeah, it's definitely going to need up if that's what they plan on doing. I think it's a great initiative for to tackle the climate change that that's happening everywhere. But at the same time, for tackling that, I have already changed my car. So even if I have to drive in, it doesn't bother me. Uh, the tram that has just uh, started coming into Broad Street, that's a great initiative and that would tackle coming in town centre more swiftly.